Hello and welcome to the video. So today I am down and off to a We Drive Porsche Great Britain workshop event with Raz from RBR. Um, he posted this Instagram photo a couple weeks ago announcing a sort of competition um, where you had to submit a 60 second video about why you should, you should be selected. Um, I did that um, and I got selected, I think with a bunch of other people. And then we're going to be doing a workshop event where we learn to present, um, learn to make videos, get some tips and tricks, etc. cetera. Um, and I, th I think we get to drive a 911 as well. So I'm taking you guys along with, with me today. I'm driving the GT4 down to the event now, even though it's minus five degrees and I've got cup two tires on, but uh, I thought we'd take you guys along for, uh, for the fun. Right, we have arrived. I think we've arrived because there's a lot of 911s here. I imagine these will be the ones we'll be driving. Sure, nice to meet you. Yeah, how's it going? It's not too bad, I'm not too far, I'm 35 minutes. So the event started off with a lunch and it kind of gave us the chance to meet everyone else that was there. The other guys at the event today were absolutely awesome and it was great to see so many other kind of passionate upcoming automotive quote unquote journalists or content creators. We then got a talk from Raz, the main man himself, with some tips that he kind of learned over the years through doing YouTube. The driving is really driving impressions. And before the light began to fade, we hopped out onto our third activity of the day, driving a 911 in pairs. And my partner was Sumit. Will and Sumit, I've paired you guys up. You're going hey. in a Grand 4 GTS. Ooh, very nice. Got the grip. Uh, then last one. All right, here we go. Driving first. Then we're going to swap halfway. In the Carrera 4 GTS. We're here with Sumit, another guy who's on the uh, on the workshop today with Raz. <laughs> it is cold today. So I've never driven a uh, GTS Carrera GTS before. This is my first time. We're looking at about 470, 480 BHP and about 570 torque. <laughs> it's quick. Feels fast enough. <laughs> I don't know if the camera's picking that up. That'll pick up. You'll hear that. You'll be able to hear You'll that. Hear that. Sounds really good. So it's just popped up on the dash. Please go into wet mode because it's noticed that it's wet outside. It's crazy. Um, so if you didn't know, the Carreras have sensors in the wheel arches that can tell when it's wet outside and then tell you to put it into wet mode so it adapts the driving method and the uh, the throttle, the gear changes and it adapts it for the driving, for the wetness outside. <laughs> right, so here we go. This is the Carrera 4 GTS. A911 four-wheel drive. I really, really like this. It's uh, really dynamic. It's mad how, what, what, what tires are we running right now? We're running the Pirellis. Given today's kind of weather conditions and it's all wet and greasy and cold, this is hooking up really well. And that's probably because Porsche know how to set up a car. Um, it is. It honestly is the everyday sports car. It is really quick. But then when you switch off into normal mode, it can be a normal, normal car, like a normal everyday car. Have we got carbon ceramics? We do have carbon ceramics, and that's kind of why it's stopping so well as well. Really good brake pedal. It's a lovely car. Absolutely lovely. Do you want to swap? Hell yeah. Let's go for it. <laughs> The GTS sounds so good. It pops like mad. Red limiter. Yeah, it's horrible. <laughs> I can't keep the power 
So we'll I'll link Samit's Instagram down in the description box. It's Dr. Go Sam. check him out. There you go. The pressure of parking a 911. It's not that bad because I've got 360 <laughs> camera, man. It's alright. The whole of YouTube's watching you right now. <laughs> <laughs> We're now going to be filming a piece to camera with this GT3 yeah. or this touring, whichever one comes up first. Um, and then Jamie is filming some professional clips for the guys here today. And then I can use those clips um, wherever, however I choose for this YouTube channel or the Instagram reels, whatever. Um, I'm talking very quietly because I don't want to ruin these guys' pieces to camera. All mic'd up. Very professional. Hello and welcome to the video. So today we're filming a 911 GT3 touring. Here's five key facts that you didn't know about the 911. A lot of camera equipment going on. <sighs> Look at that beauty. So some of you eagle-eyed viewers would probably know that this is the same 911 that Joe Achilles recently took to Spain. Um, and I think, I think Petrol Ped had a good um, play around with this as well on his channel. But yeah, this is one of the press, press cars uh, GT3 touring. Right, I'm sticking the camera here in Raz's face. Raz, hello, welcome to the channel. Look at my red nose. I know, I feel sorry for the guy. So Bloody what have you been cold. doing here today? So we have given, basically we want to get different voices into car journalism. And Porsche, very kindly, I don't know why, supporting me in doing this, because they're not getting anything out of it. But really want to bring, you know, younger people, people from different backgrounds to share a voice that's different to the one that we're used to. So, you know the demographic of your general car journalist. It's not someone who looks like me or yourself. You know, it's older people, older white people usually, who get the say and get the opportunities. And we want to bring younger generation, different backgrounds, so you can bring your voice into it, which is going to be more relevant going forward into a completely you know, changing landscape uh, in terms of the car industry. It's really something that I'm quite passionate about because I see the industry changing. And plus, I think it'd be nice just to have a different school of people around. Yeah, so it's been a fantastic day. Have you enjoyed it? Yeah, it's been really good. And Helpful. It's really good to meet loads of other people. Loads network. of people, good, good guys, a lot of passion. Um, Do you know if they're going to be running more of these next year at all? Or? I suspect they will because we had one previously that was focused a lot on uh, female drivers and getting more women into journalism. And I think it's something that hopefully that they will continue because they're passionate about it as well. Um, and it's the, it's the right, because if you think for them long term, if they get different people reviewing their cars with a different view, not just the same view again and again, it's good for them as well, for them selling more cars. Yeah. So it all makes sense. So hopefully, hopefully yeah. it's useful for you guys. Yeah, it's been fantastic. Really enjoyed yeah. it. So it's, it's a short time to do it and to get tips and stuff. But if it helps, then hey, we've done, yeah. we've done our job. Thank you much, Raz. Appreciate it. Today. Yeah, stuff. now and then it's good to get like different people in. Yeah, because you get a different perspective. <laughs> Right, guys, I'm going to leave the video here. Thank you very much for watching. A big shout out and thank you again to Raz and Porsche GB for hosting today's event. It's been, been fantastic meeting everyone here, um, connecting, getting to drive some of the cars, getting around the GT3s. Um, I have no idea how this video is going to have gone. Um, typically with these events, you've, you've just got to get as much content as you can. And then you, in the post editing process, that's how you kind of make the story. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe, the usual, and I'll see you later in the next video.